Between these two women, which one is poor? Justin thinks the answer is B. I think the answer is B. <laughs> you can hear and control me, but you can never see or touch me. You're gonna tell us the answer right now or else. Which way did she choose? <laughs> About to risk her life <laughs> on an emoji. <laughs> now you have to tell me which of these three people will die. Welcome to the Lanky Box Amusement Park. <laughs> okay? And they're going down. <laughs> What is up, guys? Welcome to this episode of Lanky Box. Yeah! Today, we're seeing if Justin can solve some crazy, impossible riddle. Justin will now be showing several different riddles. If he can guess the answer to most of them correctly, he gets to play a special game with prizes at the end. Let's go. Okay, Justin, let's see how many of these you can solve. Guys, check out the merch, lankyboxshop.com. You can get everything we're wearing. And let's get into the first riddle right now, which is this scary ghost riddle. Huh? Chucky was home alone ah, for the weekend. Dude, is that a ghost? <laughs> no, no. Chucky. <laughs> His parents were away on business. Okay, Chucky home alone. He was allowed to do anything. Yeah, oh, yeah. Except go in the basement. Don't do it, Chucky. <laughs> Don't do it. Obviously, as soon as his parents were gone, he rushed Chucky, down there. You idiot, Chucky. <laughs> what are you thinking? The basement was cold and creepy. <laughs> Old broken toys on the floor. Oh, yeah, yeah. A huge web on the wall. Yeah, spooky. In short, dusty and boring. Okay, yeah. Suddenly, Chucky... Chucky heard a voice from somewhere above him. Who was talking to him? Chucky, you're not allowed down here. True. Your parents will be furious. True. Please don't tell them. I won't tell them anything if you answer my question. Oh, okay, now he's gonna play a riddle game with a ghost. Yeah. You can hear and control me, but you can never see or touch me. What am I? Okay. You can hear and control me, but you can never see or touch me. Now, have you ever had a ghost? Ask you a question like this? I have had many ghost encounters on this show. Can really? I get a little rewind, a little <laughs> replay of Top Lanky Box ghost encounters? They were scary. They really were. What can you never touch? You can hear and control me, but you can never see or touch me. So any sound would satisfy this riddle. You can hear music. You can control music. You know, volume up, volume down. Uh -huh. But you can never see or touch it. There's too many answers. I quit. You're just giving up? Um, I'm giving up. Wait. Oh, okay. What about like rumors? You can hear and control rumors or gossip, but you cannot see or touch them. What rumors have been spread about you? <laughs> Far too many. <laughs> really? Blasphemous. Like rumors. what? People be out here saying I'm not three. <laughs> 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 yeah, not even close. Who says that about you? <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> I say that about you. Yeah. I am going to verify my answers now because I have many solid answers with my ghost. Friend consultant. Okay, okay, I'm coming in. Oh, you're gonna with, communicate with ghosts? I'm going to commune and summon any spirits which might be in the vicinity. Okay. Cookie <laughs> ah! ah! says back up! Well, I'm not a ghost! Ah! This goes super not there. <laughs> Alright, ghost. Tell us the answer to this riddle. I'm not a ghost. Is I'm your the, best friend. Is the answer <laughs> rumors? No, but you're close. Is the answer lies no. or secrets? No. Timmy's got you on tape, Adam. Coogie says ghost. I'm going to ask you one more time. Is the answer music? No. Okay, all these answers work, though. This riddle's busted. <laughs> Timmy said, what is so funny? And now the ghost hunting video crew's gonna come in. <laughs> they say, ghost, we're gonna give you one more chance. You're gonna tell us the answer right now or else. Googie will cast a curse on you and Jimmy will film it. You're using the answer right now. Well, not anymore. The answer's a video camera? No, that you are using the answer Right? Now? Yes, now! You can hear me and control me. The answer is now? No. <laughs> Are you trying? <laughs> You're using the answer. Not right now. <gasps> right now! Oh! <laughs> Your voice? Yeah! And the answer to the riddle is, keep it's the, a voice! Keep the cameras rolling! <laughs> keep it rolling! <laughs> Voice. Yeah, because you can hear and control your voice, okay, but you can never see or touch it. <laughs> you can control your voice a lot better than me. You've been taking singing lessons. I have. Why don't you show us some singing? No, Justin, you're my best friend. 
<laughs> now Justin got that one right. Let's go. Now I actually have my own riddle that I made for you and the Lanky fam at the end of the episode. Okay. So if you guys can guess that correctly, I might DM some of you guys to so watch the full video and see if you can solve that at the end. But for now, we're gonna go on to the next riddle right now, which is this tricky emoji riddle. Emoji. Okay. Now here's how this one starts. Okay. okay. Liliana was traveling in the mountain. Okay. Cool. She got completely lost. Uh oh. Suddenly she came to a crossroad. Okay. There were four different roads. Each road had a sign. <laughs> but the signs. But the signs had no words. Okay. Still, she knew which path to take. Okay. Which way did she choose? Okay, now there's four roads. You can only pick one, and all the other three lead to danger. Are you trolling me? So you gotta figure out which of these roads is the safe road. Let me get this straight. Liliana about to risk her life <laughs> on an emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at the choices. First, we have the ha stop. That one. <laughs> this one. I like that one. Rock on. This one, one of my favorites. Uh huh. And then you got this one. Now I am actually an emoji expert. Really? Yeah. Now this first emoji, this might be it because when I ask girls out on a date, they often send me this. I think it's like a high five. Let me try that with Adam's iPhone. No. Yeah. Yeah. Adam, you don't know who you're messing with. I am actually an emoji enforcer. Yeah, Adam, you weren't expecting this, were you? No. We are actually an emoji enforcement task force. Really? Cookie says, yeah, you got to respect it. Cookie <laughs> says, I got all the emojis <laughs> on my hat that you want girls to send you, but that they don't. Okay. Now, Wait, I get this. This one I want to ask girls out, so that's good. <laughs> I'm gonna analyze this very closely. This one I think means no, stop, don't go down here. This means rock on. I believe this means there's rocks in this path. Ooh, smart. This one is good. It's a okay. I'm tempted to say that's the one. Now, this one right here, this normally means like good luck or like, oh, I'm, like hoping. I'm hoping. Uh, that's not very reassuring. Now, off the bat, I'm probably going to say this one. That's like the good symbol. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? See if you guys can solve this before Justin. This one is tricky, but the answer to it is pretty fair. Really? Yeah, it has a real answer. It's not like some troll answer. The answer is the right hand. Wait, so I got it right. Yes, because you technically got it right, but it, the actual answer is because all the other hands in here are left hands. Like, all the emojis are the left hands. Wait, so I got the riddle right. Why did you keep trying to lead me on? You got it right, but not for the <laughs> yeah, right reason. Yeah, why well, hey, you still count. <laughs> okay, yeah. see if you guys were able to figure that out. Justin got that one right. And we're gonna move on to the next riddle right now, which is, who is poor? Oh, man. Now, so you have to decide between these two women which one is poor. Okay. But that's not all the information. One of them has been living in poverty for the last 10 years and just knocked out a man to pay her big debt. Can you figure out which one of them did it? Now, this is obviously a riddle for me because <laughs> I'm looking at a fridge. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna figure this out. Okay. <laughs> First, starting with the lady on the left. A, okay? Okay, she's got a nice green dress. Okay. Maybe that's part of it. That, you're trying to deceive me, Adam. She's got some ice cream in the freezer, got uh -huh. some boxes, got uh -huh. some sausages, got a Big Mac, got the whole Happy Meal. Okay. Okay. She got a bunch of eggs. She got five eggs, some pizzas, it looks like, and some sauce and some boxes. She got a lot of food in there. B has fish in the freezer. <laughs> That's interesting. Okay. She's got some meats and some cheeses and some fruits. Okay. <laughs> Dude, my IQ is actually, like, legit so high. I don't even know. Like, that's why they had to ban me from the SAT. Really? Yeah, that's why this morning I had to go take the ACT instead. I got banned. You took the ACT this morning? Yeah, I did. How'd you do? I did pretty good. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I spelled my name correctly. <laughs> the whole way. I'm thinking it's this. Look at the woman on the right. Uh -huh. Look at her fridge. Do you notice anything? Oh! She has pie and cheese, but they both are the same shape. Yes? Wait, that's actually it. These foods have been cut. That's a slice of pie and a slice of cheese, and she cut the meat in half. Uh-huh. Which means she owns a knife. Okay. Which tells okay, you what. Okay, big brain, big ouch, big <laughs> brain. Wait, that's right. Okay, nothing in here has been cut in half. On the left, nothing has been cut. So you think that because the woman on the right owns a knife that she is rich? No, it means that she might have used that to knock somebody out. <laughs> 
<laughs> what is so funny? I actually Okay, so what is so, wait, what was so I don't understand what's so funny? I thought that whole train of thought was because rich people are the only ones that can afford a knife. No, you need to go back to take an ACT prep class, <laughs> don't you? Can I take some lessons from you? Yeah. What's your top ACT tip? My top ACT tip? Yeah. I would <laughs> recommend <laughs> if you don't know the right answer, guess B. B. Because the letter B can't be wrong. So I should just fill in B for every answer? That's what I did this morning. <laughs> I'm going to say it's the one on the right because she might have a knife. I don't know the answer, but I'm going to lock in B. Okay. Because I'm a B. Justin thinks the answer is B. I think the answer is B. For the sole reason because he's wearing a B costume. Let's see what the answer is. Here we go. The answer is A. A lot of people with less money spend more on on items that make them look richer, like high heels, flashy name brand clothes, and heavy makeup. They usually spend more than they earn, so a full fridge for just one person reveals the truth. Okay, what? <laughs> that doesn't even make no sense. That makes negative sense. Because and if you're poor, you want to try and like buy stuff that you can't even afford so you can like fake flex. So the answer is not B. No. The answer is not always B. No, which means that you should absolutely go retake the ACT because you probably failed. I gotta go make a call again. <laughs> Justin got that one wrong, and we're gonna go to the next riddle right now, which is who will die? <laughs> okay, now there's three people riding a roller coaster. Okay. Now you have to tell me which of these three people will die. That's the entire riddle? That's the entire riddle. Now see if you guys can solve this one. So in the front, we have a girl that looks very scared. In the middle, we have a guy that looks like he's having a great time. Uh -huh. And in the back is a dude that's facing the wrong way. So you gotta tell me which of these three will <laughs> Die. The riddle trying to distract you. It's trying to make you think it's the girl because she looks freaked out. Uh -huh. Or the guy in the back because he turned around. But it's really the guy in the middle because he had no seatbelt. Okay, so you think it's the guy in the middle because he doesn't have a seatbelt? I'm 100% sure. I'm 100% sure. And I can prove it. Okay, I'm going to come in with a green roller coaster like in the riddle. Okay. Okay, and we're going to get three people to ride it. We got Kooky, we got Chimmy, and go ahead and bring our boxing. Okay. The guy in the back has red hair that's kind of like pink. Kooky's, and he's facing backwards. Kooky's facing backwards. Okay, and then hair. in the middle can be the guy with no seatbelt. That's Boxy. That's Boxy. Okay. Let me make a spot for Boxy. <laughs> wow! This is a pretty nice roller coaster. <laughs> Honestly. When the whole squad pull up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. First, like in the riddle, I'm going to give a seatbelt. To the people in the front and the back. Okay. Okay. Okay, Jimmy's getting strapped in. Boxy can barely even fit in the roller coaster. Yeah, he's a little bit too thick. <laughs> Welcome to the Lanky Box Amusement Park. Okay, now we're gonna do a real life simulation. Okay. Jimmy and Kooky have seatbelts like in the riddle. Boxy does not. Okay. Here we go. Okay. They're going up. Click, 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 click. Jimmy's in. Yeah. <laughs> and they're going down. And they're doing a loop deal. <laughs> and they're doing a 360 spin. Oh, 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 but they're still in it. Yeah. Oh, but Boxy. Oh. Boxy has fallen out. He looks a little deceased. Boxy has perished. Hi, Boxy. <laughs> they're going in for another round. <laughs> yes, it's the guy in the middle. He got no seatbelt. Because you think he would fall out just like Boxy did. Yes, look, the seatbelts are holding the other two in. No matter what, Jimmy says, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see what the answer is. Okay. The answer is the guy in the middle because he has no seatbelt. Let's go! Okay, Justin got that one right, and we can go to the next riddle right now, which is which mom is more stupid? <laughs> All right, so there's two moms here, and each of them has a baby. Okay. You gotta figure out which mom is the stupider one. Okay, I mean, they're both looking pretty dumb. The one on the left, her baby is in a tree. <laughs> okay, climbing a tree. And she's just drinking coffee. She's chilling. The one on the right, the baby has it. <laughs> hands in a fire. <laughs> These moms are both stupid. What are you talking about? <laughs> but you have to figure out which one is more stupid. Okay, I'm gonna say honestly it's the one in the right because the one on the left, I mean, look, th that's still pretty dumb, but if the baby falls, at least she could catch him. Uh-huh. The one on the right is straight up in a fire. But she is right next to water, so if the baby caught on fire, she could just extinct <laughs> 
<laughs> the baby caught on fire. She could throw it in the ocean. What are you saying? It has got to be the one on the right. I don't understand how it could be any other way. This okay. baby's literally touching fire. Guys, hands in the fire. Let's see what the answer is. Okay. The answer is uh -huh. the mom on the right. Yeah. Because of the fire. That's it. And Justin got that one right. Which means Justin got four out of the five riddles correct. You did real well. You get to spin the wheel. Let's see what Let's your prize go. is. Comment below some prizes. Do you want to step next? Wait, Adam, you said you had a riddle for me and the Lanky fan. I do have a riddle, and I'm going to put it on the screen right now. So see if you can solve that in the comments. We're going to pick a couple of people that can get it right, and we're going to DM some of okay. you guys. Hey, let's see what I want. You can't be wrong. Okay, okay, nice. If Justy wins, he has to do the renegade dance, but instead of saying renegade, he has to say Oreo. Okay. No, we should film this and put this on the Lanky Box World TikTok. Uh, okay, okay. Okay. Renegade. <laughs>